This week, we're talking about the new TRX-6. And we discuss the new Traxxas Max. Stay tuned. Welcome. <laughs> Episode number 83. Welcome. Episode 83. All Tracy Hobby Show. He's Chris. He's Aaron. So on tonight's episode, we unbox the new TRX-6. We get to squish six tires this time. Yeah, not even just four, six. That's a lot of squish. That's squidgy. Yeah. Yeah. So we got to talk about that. Yep. We're also going to talk about the new TRX, or not TRX, Trax the new Max. Max. Yeah. Close. I guess it's TRX, it's a TRX Max. Max. Yeah. TRX it's Max. a TRX part number. Yeah. <laughs> we got to talk about the Max. So, uh, yeah, we've got some, some footage and some extra pictures and stuff like that about yeah. the Max. So we're really excited about that. So do you want to talk about that first or do TRX 6? Doesn't matter to me. Well, let's just uh, show you guys yeah. and gals the new TRX 6 unboxing. Let's. Okay, so we have the new TRX 4, but it's really a TRX 6 in my mind. Yeah, um, I guess it kind of would be, right? Yeah, because I mean, TRX 4 would be four wheel this drive. This is a ginormous box. Drives. Yeah, it's ginormous. So quick rundown. So the wheelbase between the first two wheels, so this one and this one, is 12.75, which would be your standard yep. uh, Land Rover Defender. Defender or Tactical Edition. But the overall wheelbase from the furthest back axle to the front axle is 17.9 inches. Yeah. That's huge. That's huge. That's well over a foot. Yep. There you go. It's almost two. <laughs> but anyway, um, this is also going to come with lights. So headlights, roof rack lights, tail lights. Um, the truck is totally lit. It's lit. So let's open it up, Chris. What color? I wonder what color we got. They gave me the knife because I assume they want me to use it. Yeah, Chris is like, I totally am okay with knives. He's gonna cut himself. Don't cut yourself, Chris. You're not my boss. You're not my boss. Well, only when, well, okay, some days only when you work here. Here, let's try. I almost got it. Uh, keep my hands behind my back. Yeah. Good job. It's in there, guys. So this is oh, not. Oh, it's just foam. Yeah. This is not going to come with any different radio or anything from any of the other TRX-4s, other than if you buy a Sport. Don't touch. He doesn't have the knife in his hands. Anymore. Attitude, man. It's, get a little, a little stabby. I don't even want to show them. I'll, I'll. Pull it out slowly. Oh. <laughs> wow, there's no, like... So... Look at that black Mercedes. Six-wheel drive. Yeah. A little body. Nice Pretty neat body. Nice metallic in the body too. Oh, it is metallic. Yeah. Very nice. I yeah. wasn't sure. The pictures really did Looks not Looks like it's justice. flat. Yeah. Yeah. So, I mean, really this is your standard TRX4 other than it is going to come with two new frame rails, yep. obviously for your extension. So they didn't just do what Axial did by putting Both a frame rail extension. On. They whole just new did frame. Yeah, whole new frame rails. Obviously there's going to be two brand spanking new uh, rear inner fenders. Um, there's also going to be 2.2 wheels and tires, which are also brand yeah, spanking new. Yeah, new style of tire, eh? Yeah, brand spanking new for this model. Is it an actual beadlock tire? I don't think so. I don't, don't so. think it is. No, it just no, looks like it totally is. totally is not. No. So, not beadlock, look-alike beadlock. Um, going to be waterproof, as uh, all the TRX 4s mm -hmm. are. Um, so, it's kind of neat. This is going to have front and rear locking diffs yeah. on all of the axles. And it looks like the rear diffs are all controlled on one servo. Yeah. So, you won't be able to control them individually. So, so lock or unlock uh, the rear diff. There's your locking uh, diff right mm -hmm. there. Um, your standard just front locker, uh, your two speed, two -speed. servo is going to be over you got here. Your light control kit because this yep. truck does come with lights. You got the headlights, side markers, roof lights, uh, the front markers on the hood, and then some tail lights as well. Yeah. So this truck's going to be fully lit up right out of the box, which is really, really neat. Um, I mean, it's kind of nice that tracks this. It's is, plastic. It's plastic. It's plastic. It's plastic. It's kind of neat. There that was Traxxas. misconception on whether or not they were metal. They're definitely plastic. Plastic bumpers. Um, so it's kind of cool. Um, so this is how they have the rear suspension yeah, geometry nice set new, up. Yeah, uh, nice new link setup. So the, the links aren't connected to the middle diff, which is nice. So they yeah. can both move independently. And a quite nice articulation, honestly. Yeah, very nice. So it's quite very nice. Traxxas definitely didn't just throw this together. Um, they really made a point on making this a lot better than what uh, the SCX10 six by six is. So uh, all four link front and back um, for the two axles. Like I said, the diffs will lock portals on all of the axles as well. So you don't lose any of the height between the mid axle or anything like that. Brand spanking new mid axle yep. too. So before you did not have the PTO diff cover output for it. Um, so that's all brand spanking new for this as well. Um, so Traxxas, I mean, honestly, this thing looks sick. I really like it. I do. I like it too. 
It's kind of neat. I'd buy this. But everything else electronics wise is gonna be the same. So XL5 HP. Get the body which, on sale looks. Which will handle two or three S. Uh, you're gonna get the 21 turn reverse 550 motor, uh, as per usual, 2075X, three 2065s for your shifts and locking. Um, but yeah, honestly, ooh, super nice. You hear it? Side pit. Side pit. Honestly, it's super nice. It's sweet. You gonna buy it? I almost want to. Take it out shower on Thursday? I almost want to. There you go. There is the brand new TRX, what we're gonna call TRX6, because it's really not four-wheel drive. It's six-wheel drive. So we're gonna call it TRX6. Um, but yeah, the new Mercedes. We're not Benz. calling it TRX6. I'm gonna call it TRX6. No. You're gonna watch me do it. What are you gonna do? You're not my TRX, TRX six by six. There you go. I like that. I see yeah. one issue for installing if you want to do six wheel steer on it though. You gotta get past that. that yeah. Noise. Well, I think we can. Well, it was a well looking way. Exactly. But it's gonna be available to pre order. Uh, so get your pre orders in. It's also gonna be obviously on display at Ultra. So if you wanna come check it out, come check it out here mm -hmm. and uh, yeah, come see it. Bye. Bye. So, we unboxed a new TRX6, yeah. as you can see. So we're pretty actually excited about this mm. truck. I really just noticed how nice the lights were. The front end is super nice. There's a lot of detail like in this body. Looking light. Yeah. Mm. The only thing I will say that Traxxas uh, kind of missed on is uh, the body, the sunroof, is cut fully out. black. And all yeah. the other windows are just like fogged, what the heck? tinted. Everything else, though, is pretty nice. So it kind of leads me to believe what else is going to be on this platform. Yeah. Are they going to release some sort of like a military truck? That Are would they going to cool. release a flat deck? Like, Makes what else is next? They might try to bring back the tactical unit as 6x6. Six six. Maybe. Like one of, yeah. I mean, so if you're a really fan cool. of the tactical unit, maybe you could pick it up as a 6x6. Six six. Who knows? Yeah. yeah. Or maybe like kind of in that style of yeah. like a military vehicle. Yeah. I think it's cool. I'd like to see a flat deck. I like the new wheels and tires. I really like those. Yeah. Um, it's kind of nice. They're not as uh, kind of outrageous and yeah. gaudy. I'm not a fan of the bolts. That's the only thing I don't like. They just yeah. like I don't like how, how they poke out. I feel like you're gonna catch those on rocks and everything, and they're not gonna last long. True. Very true. But yeah, there's a new TRX6. So we are taking pre-orders on it right now. Yes. Um, and you can come down to the store to check it out. So it comes in this metallic black or like a super bright gunmetal, but a little bit darker than the Defender. Yes. Yeah. It's kind of a really cool color. I really like it. Uh, honestly, either or would be really cool. Mm -hmm. But I'm really interested to see what people do with this new chassis with building yeah. flat decks and things yeah. like that. This is so, a versatile chassis. I think you can take some abuse. Yeah. Well, that's it. So that's a new TRX 6. By 6. By 6. But really, it's a TRX 4 in this box. But whatever. They it's like. 2 speed. Yeah. So it's a 6 by 6 by 2. Dash. 4. I'm so got lockers. We got I'm so confused now. <laughs> what do the lockers compute to? Well, there's four spider gears in each of those, and there's also a ring of pinions, so it's like a 12 by 18. I'm confuzzled. But anyway, let's move on. Trax is released in Vegas this week. Obviously, Chris and I didn't go to Vegas no. because we're not cool enough. No. Uh, we totally could have, but. Apparently, I'm not allowed to leave the country. He was <laughs> just to tell anybody. Shh. That's, my, that's our secret. Shh. <laughs> but anyway, um, they released the new truck in Vegas. So this is what we know about it so far. Mm -hmm. One ten scale. Yeah. Marginally bigger than a Stampede. It's electric. It's electric. Four so tires. Brand. Four wheel drive. Yeah. Talk, continue on the trend of fours. Yeah. Four S capable. Yes. Twenty four. Their first ten scale it can be four cell. Yep. Twenty four hundred kV. 540 XL, yeah. so a long can yeah, 540. The new VXL 4X. Yep, speed control. So I assume it's just some like dumbed down VXL 6S or something like that. Yeah. Capable of like 65 mile an hour. Yeah. Uh, in the video right from Traxxas, the thing does wheelies at pretty much any speed mm -hmm. on 4S. Mm -hmm. So you have to run their 5000 long or their 5000 short 4S pack mm -hmm. in that truck. So it's going to be interesting to see. Yeah. One rumor that I will crush right now because I have looked at all of the parts explosions all and the exploded parts. view is it's all new parts it's other all than parts. like a very few things like it uses original Revo, uh, E-Revo, Nitro Revo, Emax, T-Max, U-joints for the drive shafts but all new Standard plastic drive yeah. shaft. Um, the diffs are Revo looking. Mm -hmm. They are not Revo. Um, Revo I had style. A, I've had a couple questions about them being Revo, but they're not an 8600 yeah, the, the part The Revo number. ring and pinion are way bigger, I think. 
Yeah. It's a, especially the Arriva 2.0. Yeah, I mean, so it's, it's big ring gear. The one thing that threw me off right away is that all the parts on this new Traxxas Max are 8,900 part numbers. Mm -hmm. So usually how Traxxas does their part numbers is the first two digits are gonna dictate the style of truck. Mm -hmm. Like for example, um, slash or four by four parts yep. are 6,800. And then the last two numbers are generic. So for example, 6881 is a diff case. Yeah. 53, which is original like Revo, 81 is going to be a diff case. So they'd kind of keep that flowing throughout the lineup. So it's kind of nice, but yeah, all the parts are going to mm -hmm. be 8,900 part numbers. So they are all going to be new. New parts. The price is a little on the hefty a side. A little steep, yeah. yeah. It's going to be more for your hardcore bashers. Someone yes. that drives a slasher stampede that isn't quite getting what they want out of it. They break it every time they drive it. It's not big enough. All those features. It's an eight scale platform in a ten scale truck. Yeah. So gonna nice. it's going to be like a seven hundred and twenty dollar truck. Yep. Plus taxes. Still needing a battery and a charger. It's going to be on this, a little on the steep side. So very it's, close to the Erevo. So yep. there's your there's your contemplation is do you want an Erevo? Or do you want a max? So Chris and I were talking about this pretty in depth, actually. Or just before, get both before we came on and to like talk to everybody. Me. But the biggest thing with the new Traxxas Max is: do you want, like he said, a ten scale truck, single battery, yep. or do you want an eight scale truck, dual battery? Mm. That is going to be the biggest contemplation. The pricing is very similar. I mean, you can buy a Revo for about fifty bucks more, yep. um, but now you need to buy two Revo batteries. Yeah, that's like the specifically thing for the Revo, going to dual battery and single battery yeah. vehicle. And you also need to buy a dual charger now, do all that extra stuff. So what's going to be the difference? Traxxas's biggest selling feature now with this isn't just training mode. The other thing that they are really talking about is going to be the ability to run in multiple different personalities by the amount of cells you put in the truck. Yeah. So right? you're running it on two cell. It's going to be a nice and tame little monster truck. Someone who's just starting out is going to be able to drive it fairly yeah. easily. But if you want to go ballistic, you know, ballistic, just throw a little force throw in there. Yeah. So like 65 Backward. miles an hour is going to be pretty, do. pretty, pretty good. So uh, Chris Mueller and Dan Schellenberg from High Performance Distributors are down in Vegas. They got the bash it for a couple hours, and Traxxas was jumping their semi truck trailer, mm -hmm. like side with with ways, I guess. On the flat pavement. On the flat concrete. Um, they finally broke it after two hours, but I mean, doing that with a stampede. Probably wouldn't take it. No. I mean, doing that with a Revo, it probably would for a bit. Yeah. And then it would probably and break. As long as, as well. you land properly. Yeah. That's the biggest thing is it didn't break because it's junk. It broke because you landed it wrong. Correct. So it's half of my problem. We're pretty excited to see you on. We are going to get a pre delivery just like we did on TRX 6 here, mm -hmm. the G500 and all those other trucks. So we're really pumped about that. We're really excited to see it in store. The pre delivery unit is going to come with lights. Um, everyone after that is not going to come with lights, so Traxxas kind of pizzazzes it up yeah, for us. Yeah, makes it look a little fancy. Yeah, so we are going to get one. We're going to do an unboxing video. We're going to talk about it. Chris might actually buy it to bash yeah, it. Yeah, pick this one up, I think. Yeah. Ooh. So we're we're actually going to use this one as a demo. Unit. And then when they are purchasable, Chris will buy it from the store. Mm, exactly. Um, he's not going to give us any money to use it. Um, that's yeah. a common misconception. We're just going to let him use it, get footage for the show, obviously, and go have fun with it exactly. and, and try and sell it to people. So, yeah. I mean, that is always the goal. Yeah. So, we're really excited about that. So, it's kind of crazy. There's so much new stuff coming on down the pipes. Mm -hmm. um, so, yeah, I guess uh, we'll show you some video and, and some clips and a couple other things we have in the new Max right now. Traxxas yeah. Max. Yeah. Pretty cool. I really like the body style. It yeah, looks it really looks good. cool. Yeah, it looks really good. Looks like a tiny Max. It's an X Max 0.5. Mini. Yeah. It's a mini. Mini Max. A mini Max. So, yeah, mini that max. is uh, what we know about that. Mm -hmm. So, I guess that's really the end yeah. of episode number that's 83. We Next week, you can have some UDR footage. I just installed a new Protec 170 SBL brushless servo. So, it's ridiculous. Been, uh, nuts. Yeah. Yeah. 
But there we go. Thanks for stopping by. So don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Exactly. Don't forget that hit the bell to get notifications on when we drop a new video. Don't forget to check us out on our social media platforms, him first. Mm -hmm. Don't forget to check him out on Instagram, Snap, or Instagram, YouTube, and Facebook. I always say Snapchat for some reason, but I, it's not right. RZ Deebs, don't forget to check us out on Instagram, Facebook, Snapchat, and YouTube, uh, Ultra RC Hobbies. Mm -hmm. Don't forget to check out our website, www.ultrarchiehobbies.com. He's got her. But thank you so much for watching, we really do appreciate it. And we'll catch you on the next one. Bye.